Okay, get ready, get ready. Turn on your cam. We're going to learn something today. Come. Ready? Wait, I'm going to share this sound. And I'm going to uh, play it and pause it at the same time. And then I'll explain a little bit. All right, so the first one. Quite an eerie feeling to walk through these the streets because you don't see anybody, you don't hear any cars, you don't see anything, and most of the places have just been closed. Okay, one it's more quite time. an eerie feeling to walk through these streets. It's quite an eerie feeling to walk across the streets. You can say it's quite an eerie feeling. You can write number one, eerie feeling. Eerie feeling, it's like a bit creepy and scary. All right? Mostly because there's nobody there. Okay? Mostly because there's no body there. Oh, sorry. You should send it to everyone. Okay? You all can write, huh? The first one, it's eerie. Eerie feeling. Okay, one more time. It's quite an eerie feeling. It's quite an eerie feeling to walk across a street. Or you can say to walk across a ghost town. You can say ghost town. Ghost town is like Sichen. It's like you go to a place, there's no people, uh, there's nothing, there's no businesses. Right? Because there's nobody there, no businesses, nothing. Okay? Y'all can write it down, huh? It's quite an eerie feeling. Okay? okay. It's quite an eerie feeling to walk through these streets because you don't see anybody, you don't hear any cars, you don't... Hey, Polo family. So you see anything, and most of the places are just... You don't see any cars, and most of the places have been shutting down. Just been closed. Wait. Have just been closed. You can say most of the places have just been closed or have just been shut down. Okay, y'all can enjoy the video first. Later, I'll play it again. You can try your best to write down the words that you don't understand. If you don't understand, you can Okay, because we'll be out, it's a pause, and then uh, because you don't know what's going on, you have to watch it first. Okay, try your best and write down everything, all the words that you don't understand. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to play it. Way more people are dying in this country than being born. A country that is closing up kindergartens and uh, wait, housing care is... By the way, wait up. Uh. Uh, the title of this video is Japan's population is heading to zero. So Japan's population means It's going to zero. means there will be no people or no humans residing in Japan. All right, the population, the Japanese population is decreasing. It's going down. Later, we will go through it. We will go further into that to learn what's the cause. What caused the Japanese to stop having babies? And why the population is aging, is getting older. Alright? Huh. means neither but then There are very less young people. Why is this a crisis? Okay, what uh, aging population is a crisis. 
crisis is like a is a national crisis. Is a national is a national crisis. Aging population is a national crisis. It could be Japan. Japan is the worst one. 最严重是 Japan. And then I think China is coming. China and London. Mm. These places, they have very serious aging population. Okay, means 老人家, right? Then who takes care of them? Who takes care of them? The young people will take care of them. 就是年轻人, 要赚钱, and then 养那些老人家. Okay, get it? I mean, okay, if let's say 那个老人家很有钱, 那个老人家很有钱, but then 他自己都没有力气, 谁要扶他们? You need a young person, right? You need young people to help them, carry them, give them medical support. 他们生病了,对吗? 老人家医他们啊,no. 我们要年轻人医那些老人家。等一下,那些老人家手症呢? They have Parkinson's disease. Okay, what is Parkinson's disease? Okay, Parkinson's disease is like 手会摇的. It's like, the trembling of the hand. All right, old people they have it. So can you risk? Okay, Hong He, if you are an old person, will you rather let the young people to treat you, or you let the old people and treat you? Which one will you choose? Young people, of course. Young doctor, right? Yeah. All right. Ah, uh, the old one later got tremble eh? It kill you eh? Ah, uh, so. <laughs> We need the young people to support the old people. Come, you all can write. We need the we need the country. All right, young people need to support the old people. If there are too less of the young generation, young people, tai sao nian ting ren liao, then who helps out the old people? Uh, who give them care? Who supports them? Right? Uh, without young people, the country's economy will be bad. Alright? And then when the country has no money, 没有钱了, then what happened? Then what happened? The country do not have enough money to support the old people. You know, just like Malaysia, we B40 group, your Laurentia, Waga Emas. And also, uh, in Malaysia, we have Waga Emas. Lah. And also, we have, uh, we have B40 group. B40 group means the poor community. Then, who will support them? 政府啦, 如果是你是, uh, B40 group, then, 你跟谁拿钱? 政府会给你钱. Understand? So, 老人家太多的话, then the country cannot, cannot support so many poor people, so many old people. So, Japan might disappear. Uh, so, later we will see it. Alright? Support is support, huh? She has to turn Laurentia. Okay? Come, y'all can uh, watch this video. All right, crazy. And if yeah. nothing changes, Japan could eventually... One more time. Places have just been closed. Way more people are dying in this country than being born. A country that is closing up kindergartens and housing cares are increasing. And if nothing changes, Japan could eventually just not exist. If you kind of extrapolate on the numbers, it's going to happen. When you actually look at these numbers, you see why they say that Japan could 
disappear. Schools are shutting down. Elementary schools, even junior high schools have been shut down. One, two, three, four kids in a class. On the right is a high school that has even shut down in the past 10 years. It starts with the small towns and cities. Towns will die, cities will die. The gap between deaths and births is getting bigger. In Japan, every city is going down. Japan's population fell by more than half a million people last year. Imagine if that happens every year. So what happens when you have so many people leaving? What does that mean for infrastructure, for public services, hospitals, schools? And just look at this chart which shows Japan's population projected decline. The country will go from being the 11th most populous country in the world to one day there will be less people in Japan than the state of New Jersey. Jersey. Only when Elon Musk tweeted, Japan went ballistic and the government just kind of freaked out. Elon Musk is warning Japan will cease to exist. This is such a common sight. You have so many abandoned stores like this across the city. I'm visiting abandoned towns and interviewing government officials. Uh, we are going to reduce the people at going out. Japan. Okay, let me explain. Uh, I rewind back. Uh, so starting from here. 你们可以写下来他们的意思啊? Way more people are dying in this country. Way more people are dying in this country. Country than being born. Than being born. Way more people dying. Way more people dying than being born. Means 死的人更多. Okay, 死的人比生出来的人多. Okay, way more people are dying than being born. Means, uh, yeah. People, I mean, uh, the birth rate is so low. Hanti. Okay, means in Japan, nobody wants to give birth. And more people are dying. When people die, the population decreases. When there is no new babies, then the population will keep shrinking. Oh, you can all can write population will keep shrinking. Okay, uh Cerny, do you know what is shrinking? The population will keep shrinking. Mm. Yes, I know. Mm? <coughs> yeah. I yeah, know. you know it. Yeah. What is it? Increase or decrease? Decrease. Decrease, correct. Okay. Uh, I will open another paper. Hold on. Mm, hold on. Okay, can I like this? Okay, I will start or uh, I will type over here. Okay. The Japanese the Japanese population will keep shrinking means will keep decreasing decreasing means going down okay born a country that is closing up kindergartens and housing cares are increasing and if nothing oh, changes japan could eventually uh just not exist okay if nothing has changed then you can write Japanese, uh, Japan will cease to exist. What is this? Um, can I have Jing um, Xiang? What is meant by cease? Yeah, what is it? What is meant by cease? If this trend continues, means 这样的, uh, trend la, means 全部人都不要生孩子, right? 一直持续下去, okay? Means more death 
damper. Ah, uh, what is this, Jingxiang? Huh? You mean like cease? Cease. Will cease to exist. Means will. What is it? You can search on Google. What is this? Echo. Huh? What? Echo of suddenly and forcibly. Mm, stop. You remember stop. Okay. Get it? Y'all can write stop. Cease means stop. Okay, imagine. Okay, now you have these old people. Okay, this population. Uh -huh. So, let's talk about death. And let's talk about birth. Okay, birth is like you will have new humans, correct? Basically, new humans. Lah. The new humans. Okay, imagine you have uh, so many people here. Okay, you all need to understand that because Malaysia will also follow soon. Malaysia will If you ask your parents, right, your parents will definitely tell you don't give birth. <laughs> your parents will say, you ask lah, your parents, you want to have a child, you want to have a mom and Then your mom will say, Okay. Right. So your mom will say, no way. Okay. So you must understand why your parents say no. Because the rising cost of living. Right. Okay. So you all can see this. Okay. If let's say got three people death. Lah, means minus how many? Okay. Let's say we got 1,000. Okay. We got 1,000 people here. Okay, imagine the population. Okay, so if let's say minus, uh, let's say one day lah, one day got 20 people die. Birthday got maybe, uh, maybe got two, two, two babies ah. Ha. So, what happened? The population will keep shrinking. So, 1,000, uh, it becomes 9982. Uh, sorry, 982 people. So, the the like population will keep shrinking. Hey, mama, pin sao, yi la yi sao, yi la yi sao. Chong yi chen pin jo bai ba sa er. All right. Am I right? Yeah, correct. Okay, get it? So, mm -hmm. if we have more deaths than births, then Japan will cease to exist. All right. So, let's see. If you kind of extrapolate, if you kind of extrapolate on on the numbers, the numbers. So what is extrapolate on the numbers? If you extrapolate on the numbers, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. If you extrapolate means if you predict an outcome based on a graph. Predict an outcome or number based on graph. Trend. Trend is like a trend. Okay, woman, the trend is like a means that you need trend either to go up or go down. All right, if you extrapolate on the numbers, just a tang, you can extrapolate on the numbers 就是说你在predict一个outcome or predict一个number 就是说你在预测 
，OK， get it？ 很像说我这个 graph， OK， 我的 graph 是我的那个图画。All right， if let's say 它是这样子的 ，OK， right， means 它一定是 keep going down 了吗？对不对 ？It keeps going down and then go down until zero. Understand? Yeah. Extrapolate means it's if you extrapolate on the numbers, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. This it refers to Japan's population heading to zero. Means Japan will disappear. Japan will will disappear. Okay. Will disappear. Will disappear. Okay, you can write it down. Once you're done, you can let me know. Because this is a very interesting topic for you to learn. And it's really happening. It's really happening. Not sure about Malaysia. Mm -hmm. If you extrapolate on the numbers, means if you predict an outcome based on the graph. Ah,、uh, based on is 根据的意思哈 right? When you actually look at these numbers, you see why they say that Japan could disappear. Yeah, they say that why Japan could disappear means might disappear, 可能会消失掉 right? Let's see. Schools are shutting down. Schools are shutting down. Elementary school. Elementary schools, y'all can write. 小学来的 primary school, elementary schools is the same as primary schools. Okay, y'all can write it down, ah.、Huh? Elementary schools, primary schools are shutting down. Kindergarten are also shutting down. Schools, even junior high schools, have been shut down. One, two, three, four kids in a class. On the right is a. Yeah, only one, two, three, four kids in the class. Okay, okay. I、uh, I want to ask somebody who goes to tuition center. Okay, I want to ask Xin Wei. Okay, do you go to other tuition centers? No. No. Ah. Okay then.、No. Never mind. Maybe you don't know what's happening in other tuition center. Okay, so uh, Jay, do you go to other tuition center? No. Huh? No, I uh do it all online. <laughs> oh, you do it all online. Okay, never mind. Just take it. Uh, just think of it this way. Okay, online class la. Together with another teacher, how many students are there in one class? Um, usually, ten to twenty. Ten to twenty, ah, still got twenty, me. Um. Uh. Maybe like fifteen. Sixteen, ah.、Uh, fifteen, sixteen, like that, but um.、Uh, I've seen some like uh classes like drawing classes. They have over two hundred. Over two hundred. Over a hundred, yeah. Like over a hundred, serious. Yeah. Uh, like drawing classes, like uh. Oh. You know, uh, oh, drawing classes. Over a hundred, ah. Wow, then the teacher must be making a lot of money, lor. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. I should be an art teacher. I never mind. Okay, just joking, right? So, uh, what about Lo Junhui? Do you go to other tuition center? No. No, you don't. Just tuition with me, lah. Ah.、Oh. Serious, ah, real, ah, really, ah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, like you see, ah, my class got how many people? You tell me. Got how many people in this class? Nine. Ah、uh, yeah, nine. Ah,、uh, excluding me, got nine people, right? If you go to other tuition center, right, maybe you can only like find ah、uh, four to, maybe like four to five students, ah,、uh, four, five or six students, very less. Okay, it's very hard to survive. Ah,、uh, if you have four to five students, huh, you cannot cover the rental. You understand means you have four students lah. If let's say one class lah, 
อีกเกอร์คลาสวันคลาสโอเคกอด only four to six students ah this is what happened when I joined the tuition center that time only got four to six students or the boss need to pay the teacher lah okay the teacher's wages teacher's wages means lao si the gong qian teacher salary some more you need to pay the rental leh ha Right, rental is one month. One month is around like uh three thousand or two thousand five. Okay, let's say three thousand. Exclude furniture. You men do the furniture ah, furniture ah, no money ah, projector. Okay, you need the projector, the screen, the projector lah, the aircon. Bills, ah, uh, the tables, the chairs, it's very hard to survive. You understand? So what will happen if there are no more kids? 没有小孩子了，没有学生了。I mean, 正常 because population is decreasing, ma. So 自然而然 the tuition class will be, the class size will be smaller. So, when class size is smaller, the 时候 then 那个 teacher 就会 charge higher price. Means your tuition fee will be very very high. 你的给的学费会更加贵 because you need to cover the teacher's wages and also you need to cover the rental. You need to cover the the furniture lah. Understand? So it's um it's happening right now. Okay, get it? So, mm hmm. I can see the trend. Maybe I was Li Okay, because nine students is considered at the lower tier. Y'all remember this lower tier means uh, 算是低下的等级 Okay, I don't know lah. Whether I'm not professional or what, or I my teaching sucks or what. <laughs> But choi okay. So, uh, I will say my. Class size is at the lower tier. You all can write class size number five. You all can write class size is at the lower tier. 我的那个 class 的那个 size 是属于比较低的呢。Okay, we have lower tier. We have medium. Uh, medium tier, 就是中等呐。Okay, lower tier will be less than ten, maybe less than ten. If let's say, uh, we look at this. The price that I'm charging, okay, the price, the fee that I'm charging is actually considered very low, very affordable. I mean, very affordable. The fee, um, is affordable. Okay, the fee is adult affordable. My class size is at the lower tier. Medium tier will be around, uh, as what Jay Chong said, it was about like fifteen to sixteen students in one class. Okay, 十五到十六个人 but higher tier is uh yeah basically what he said lah. Um, medium tier normally is twenty to thirty students like that. 大部分的补习中心都是这样子的 means got fifteen to thirty students in one class. Alright, while higher tier will be more than more than fifty already. Okay, get it or more than thirty. All right, clear. So what happened is, ha, if there's no more kids, ah, 没有小孩子啊 then 老师也没有工作 right? 老师没有工作 then 经济会变差，没有人有工作 so 接下来就是一个 crisis. Understand? 哈，没有工作，嗯， then 他就有这个 crisis. 就是变成国家经济变得很差 ，economy 会变得很差。Understand? 哈、huh? ，so that's a problem. Y'all can write. Ah,、uh, previously I went to this tuition center. Like I got four to six students only, very less. Ha.、Huh? How to cover? Oh, let's say lah, four to six students ah per month lah. You times with ah eighty ringgit. Okay. So how much is it? Ah,、uh, let's say 
four hundred eighty. Let's say four hundred eighty. Okay, let's say four hundred eighty. If let's say I take seventy percent, ah, 我是拿到多少 And then thirty percent 是那个老板嘛 Ah, so how much is it? Ah, also got printing fee 咧 Correct. Ah, example lah for other tuition centers ah. The 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 tuition center only take one hundred for forty four, or maybe 只是拿到一百块罢了 Because forty four ringgit, let's say 是给水电费那些，才一百块罢了 So which is very less. So 你会看到很多 tuition centers they are shutting down. You understand? So you have to understand what is happening. Okay, you have to use your logic. Okay. So anyway, let's see. A high school that has even shut down in the past 10 years. It starts with the small towns and cities. Towns will die. Towns will die. Towns 就是说的是，呃，很像 like 我住在 Cheras, I live in Cheras, 不在 KL. Towns is like 比较没有这样 modern 的地方 Towns will die. Cities will. Cities will die. Cities 是城市 Okay. What is it? Ah, number five. Towns will die. Cities will die. Wait on. Towns will die. Cities will die. Wait on. Me. Okay, continue. Will die. The gap between deaths and births is getting bigger. The gaps, 就是说那个。Yes, he did. Ah, 那这个人 ，Okay, so so annoying. The gaps, the gap between the what and what is getting bigger. The gap between the death and birth. You can say the gap between the between the poor and rich. 就是说贫穷 ，OK， 和富裕的那一个贫富之差越来越大。OK, means 穷的人越穷，有钱的人越来越有钱。等一下我会 on the deal. Um, wait. I want to ask Jia Kai, are you interested to know why the poor gets poorer and the rich gets richer? Are you interested to know that? I don't know. Are you interested to know why? Mm. Yes. Yes, you are interested. Okay, come, you all can write. For this, okay, never mind. Let's talk about poor and rich. Yushen, how about you? Are you interested to know it? Yeah, Yushen, are you interested to know why is the poor getting poorer, the rich getting richer? Yes. Yes, okay. Can you try to uh think why the poor people they get poorer? Why? Eh? Okay, you can speak Chinese. I I I speak Chinese, and then you help me translate. Means poor people, ah, their education will be better. Their quality of education will be better. Means, 可能你 poor 的话，然后你那一边没有什么，呃，没有什么教育的地方。有啦，有学校吧，但很多都是不 care 这样子。I mean， 讲讲
Yeah, yeah, quality. Is it you? Did you say quality? Yeah, yeah, quality. Is it you? Did you say quality? Did you say quality? Did you say quality? Hello. No. No. What did you say? Some more? Can you repeat? Qualification. Oh, their qualification is low. Is it? Yes. Yeah. For the you mean the poor people, right? Yes. Uh, yeah, some la, most of them. Uh, most of the poor people, they have low qualification. Means ,他的学历很低. Means 可能说读书读到PT3 until fin 15 years old cannot study anymore. Okay, we can. You tell me why they don't want to study anymore at 15? Is it like they really don't want to study or they cannot study because they need to work? Maybe they just lazy or just cannot read in mind because they think reading book is hard for them. It's my opinion, I don't know. Oh, you mean like the poor people, they have this, hmm. the poor people, they ah, have this mindset. Think, yeah. uh, you all can write, the, mm, the poor people, they have poor people mindset. You all can write poor people mindset, just a 穷人的思维. All right. They think that, oh, hey, uh, study no use one, lah, useless. So they think that, oh, 15 years old, I can come out. Oh, I don't want to study already. 15 years old, I come out, I work. Come out and work. For people. It's like you all can write, come out and work for people, right? Basically, 难听, 讲难听一点, 讲难听一点, they are slaves. They are slaves. Slaves are uh, slaves. Slaves are not 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 yeah, come out to the city and work for people. Then I say boss we talk nice because Tama Mio Tama just like yao like it ching kwai it ching u by kwai the gong chen to okay liao. Right? Ah, so the poor people they need to keep working, 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 working for the 1,500 ringgit. You understand? Mm. And most of the poor people. They don't have good education. All right. Huh. Because it's um I mean tuition tuition fees is getting more expensive. It's so expensive. Right. tuition center And maybe it's oh it's nothing for you, but for some people they cannot afford. So quite or maybe 50块钱一个月, So they cannot. All right. Okay, also, and then what about the rich? Why the rich people, they get richer, huh? Anyone wants to volunteer? Why? Why is the rich people getting richer? Why? Huh? Serni, Hongni, do you want to say something? Why the rich people, they are getting richer? Um, because uh, they have a more better education and then the poor people have lesser education and then so they have the more information to know how to work and then better ways to get to get money. Mm, yeah, you can say it good. You say more info, and then what? The well, rich people they have uh, more info too. Get money from 
other other um maybe country like working for other countries yeah oh yeah 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 they can if they get better quality education then they can uh they can work overseas correct because if you want to work overseas you think they want a stupid person to work overseas yeah? you think another country like Canada, they want someone who is uneducated? No. They want smart people and they want great talents. All right. So when the rich people they get, they get better quality education, then they are more talented. They are more talented. And their parents. already uh their parents can give them really good advice uh i mean their parents can afford their support them can afford and support them i mean if let's say you are poor do you think your parents can support you. Your parents understand? So I'm talking about the reality. Okay, because you will you will thank me. You definitely will thank me. Like, oh, I remember teacher Carol. Now I understand why she's talking about it. Okay. Means if you live in a in a poor from if you come from a poor family. Then you must expect Niao Yu Liao Ni the Fu Musu Pu Yang Ni the Ye Puhe support Ni Chiko Wai to Su. So what you need to do is Niao Na Jiang Xue Jing Yao Chu Ko to Su. Then if let's say Ni Chu Ko to Su, the Ming Yang Ni Han Li Hai. So you can get a better job. Right? If let's say you still stay in Malaysia, nothing, so what don't see the mayo, Ni Jiu Zen Go to Tian Wu Kwai the Gong Zo. Understand? So you will keep on living a poor life. Understand? Yeah. And then just now he said, mm, better quality education. And then uh, they have social networking. You all can write social networking. Okay. The rich people, they have already their own social network. Uh, with the richest only, okay, with the richest only, just like with the rich community only, means rich community will pair or will match with the rich community, means uh, alright, yeah, when you go to university, maybe you will meet a friend who can start the business with you. If you go to university, you will meet a friend uh, 可以跟你一起奋斗, and then 一起开一个公司的人. Yeah. If let's say you networking is very important. 你要有一个关系在那边。你的, you must remember one thing. Okay, I want to ask everybody. You think hard work, uh, sorry, hard work. Okay, I give you two choices. Hard work and choice. Which one is more important? Okay, I write over here. What do you think? Hard work or choice? Which one is more important? What do you think? Hmm. Which one is more important? Hard work or choice? I want to see how many of you. You can write it in the chat box. Hmm. Yushen, what, what do you think? Hard work or choice, Cerning? And everybody? Do you think it's more important or more important? Your choice means like, you want to say, I don't want to go to school, I don't want to go to school. This is your choice. Means you want to go to school or you don't want to go to school? This is your choice. 
，你要继续留在马来西亚，或你要出国也是一个 choice。啊、uh, ，which one is more important？ So many people say hard work. Ah,、uh, more and more responses, please. Hard work. Okay, I will say both. Both are important. Okay, 两个都一样重要 All right, hard work and choice. <laughs> All right, because you need to work hard to get to where you are. But choice is more important. 如果你给我选的话，我觉得 choice 更加重要 Okay, get it. If I had the time, I had the another chance. I would definitely. Make a choice. Make the right choice to get out of Malaysia and get experience from there. But then, ah,、uh, I made the wrong decision because nobody guided me. 没有人指导我 Understand? You must have a wise parent. You must have wise parents to tell you what to do. All right, get it? Uh、mm、huh. -hmm. So anyway. In Japan, every year it is going down. Japan's population fell by more than half a million people last year. Imagine if that happens every year. So, what happens when you have so many people leaving? What does that mean for infrastructure? For infrastructure means 那个呃设备 public services. Public services, hospitals, schools, and just look at this chart, which shows Japan's population projected decline. The country. Projected decline means decline means 下降 All right, decline. D E C L I N. Decline. Decline. Listen. Country will go from being the eleventh most populous country in the world to one day there will be less people in Japan than the state of New Jersey. Only when Elon Musk tweeted, Japan. I went ballistic, and the government just kind of freaked out. Elon Musk is warning Japan will cease to exist. This is such a common sight. You have so many abandoned stores like this. Abandoned stores is 被人遗弃了的意思 Across the city, I'm visiting abandoned towns and interviewing government officials.、Uh, we are going to reduce the people's going out. We are going to reduce the people's going out means, 他们要减少日本人出国，不要给他们，嗯，啊、uh, ，like 移民 ，right? Um, you can say they want to reduce the Japanese from leaving the country or from migrating. Migrating 是移民的意思。They want to reduce the Japanese from migrating. Means they want to leave them. Don't let them go. Understand? Don't let them immigrate. Because if they move to another country, they leave Japan. Then Japan will get uh the humans in Japan will get lesser and lesser. They will become more and more poor. Right. Japan has a huge elderly population, and it's home to the longest living people. This is what a city hall looks like when over a third of your population is over the age of sixty-five. 三分之一的人都超过六十五岁，三分之一，你 imagine that? <laughs> okay, 三分之一都超过六十五岁啊。Many young Japanese today don't want to get married or have babies. Long working hours, you don't. Meet anybody? There's no romance. So what happens when a town like this just completely ceases to exist? And is a smaller population actually a problem? Well, yes. I see depopulation is a problem. Okay, depopulation is 减少人口的意思 I see depopulation as a problem. Okay, what's 
What's the problem? Let's see. Problem decreasing the birth rate means decreasing the number of labor population. Shrinking labor force has. Okay, one more time. Yes. I see depopulation is a problem. Decreasing the birth rate means decreasing the number of labor. Okay, decreasing the number of birth rate. Okay, decreasing. Birth rate 就是说生育率降低的话, okay? means decrease in number of labor. Number of labor 是劳力, means 你没有孩子的话, 没有年轻人, Understand? Only the young people, they have the energy to do all the work. Okay, while well, old people, they don't have energy already. They are dying. And who will support them? The young people will support them. Okay? It's a very complicated thing. So All right? Because it's the old people, the older generation that push the price to go up. Uh, I mean, I don't want to uh, spread the hate. This is what's happening. Okay? Means... The older generation, okay, the older generation, they make all the things so expensive, right? Older generation, they make everything so expensive. And then the younger generation can afford or not. Young, 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 Huh, cannot afford and then at the end we have to support them. We need to support them, give them service. But of course we make money la. Right. Huh, so that's a thing. Okay. So Tumo Tong Si Kui Tumo Kui. Sing we sang min the rent tao kong. Okay, yeah, juice la ring. I mean sang min the rent eating su pita lao the ma tabu day. Then have men control chambu price. Then triple price more cow. Then younger generation, juice, beta hanel, double beta hanel, cannot afford them. Whatever, he just buy some kids, buy, buy. Okay, so, it will cause you to have this phenomenon. Okay, hmm. Okay? Mm. So that's a thing. Okay. The population shrinking labor force has six. Shrinking labor force means ah, uh, 劳力. 变得越来越少。年轻人减少的话，就是劳力越来越少。没有劳力，就没有的take consequences. GDP will decline even more. In addition to shrinking the economy, it puts a massive shrinking economy，就是经济会退化，呃，退化。Understand？经济会退化。Okay. Strain on the country. If labor population decreases, you have to support elderly people. So the burden. Then gets bigger and bigger. This is. 我很喜欢这个人讲话, okay, this guy, this young man. In addition to shrinking the economy, it puts a massive strain on the country. If labor population decreases, you have to support elderly people. So the yeah, you have to support the elderly people. All right, we need labor to support the elderly people. Means support the old people. The burden gets bigger and bigger and bigger. Burden means full Understand? The burden gets bigger and bigger and bigger. Okay? Okay, next. 
burden gets bigger and bigger. This is Honan Elementary School, and this is kind of uh, an example of what happens when we don't find kind of reason or reuse purpose for elementary schools. Jeff is a father of two living in Hakone. It's only about an hour or so outside of Tokyo, but it couldn't feel more different than one of the world's most crowded cities. About 10 years ago, this elementary school shut down completely because there weren't enough students. A lot of those children's clothes have also just kind of been shut down or combined as well. A kid growing up here might have more elderly friends than friends their own age. You have empty classrooms and what kind of an interesting initiative my school took is the elementary school is four floors. They moved all the kids up to the top three floors because there were so many empty classrooms and they used the first floor as kind of a community space for kind of the elderly in the neighborhood. The kids in this neighborhood that would normally be zoned for this school now have to go to another one and in some cases that could mean a 45 minute drive. Finding kindergartens and preschools is, is quite a challenge for a lot of adults as well. Yeah, it's quite a challenge. Finding a kindergarten or a preschool could be a challenge. Because uh, all the schools are shut down because there are not enough students. Uh, just like I gave you the example. Lo, right? uh, previously, I was in a tuition center uh, teach. All right, got four to six students only. Almost shut down because there are just not enough students to cover the, the teacher's wages and also the rental, right? It would have been nice to have kind of a bigger community, more kids to play around with. It's so crazy growing up myself in the west coast of the United States, there's always more population. There's always new schools being built, new homes being built. So the idea of a community, a school, an elementary school that just didn't have enough students to the point where it had to completely shut down, it's crazy. Jeff is an exception. See, most people in Japan are moving to bigger cities for more opportunities. Tokyo is, is a wonderful place, but uh, as you can imagine, it's really busy, not a lot of green. I wanted to kind of expose them to more nature. Okay, this is Jeff. He moved his, uh, he prefer his children, to live in Hakone. Okay, Hakone or Hakon, it's a town one hour away from Tokyo, just Li Dongjing, but uh, there's no greenery in Tokyo, so busy, which is a wise decision. Okay, I want them to expose to more nature. You all can write expose to is like uh, okay, exposed to. I want them to expose to more greenery. Expo I want them to ex to be exposed to. More greenery, more nature, and kind people to be exposed to. And kind people. Just like if you go to the city, the people there are usually very selfish and very cold-hearted. So what is cold-hearted? Just a bit more Yeah. If you go to the city, it's always like that. Kind of less structures. A new initiative will pay parents more than seven thousand dollars per kid to leave Tokyo. Especially kind of the transformation and kind of means Japan has uh what is the initiative by the government? Okay, you all can write initiative pangpa. Means like the solution. Uh, the initiative that government give is to pay the family $4,000. $4,000 is Around 18 maybe 18 just to leave Tokyo. 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 Yeah, means to pay the family, 你有孩子的话, 
你离开东京，我给你四千块新美金 ，to leave Tokyo， you go to other place， all right， and if let's say 你生孩子的话，又另外给钱你，哇，极好啊，<笑> so kind of work styles for a lot of people. A lot of it can be done in the office, and then commute times in Japan. It's not unusual to be an hour, an hour and a half. One way commute time. But the truth is, it's like the chicken or the egg. See, if a town has less people and activities, you don't want to move there. And yeah, you go to Japan. If there's no activities, there's no business there, then people are not moving there. Okay, no small yule. Okay, you wouldn't want right. You won't want to go to this place. If people aren't moving there, well, it'll only get more and more isolated. The place will get more isolated, 就是比较被遗弃啦 Okay. What's really common is you'll have people here in the '60s who invested in、uh, raising their kids, owning a home in a place in a kind of the suburbs. But the kids, understandably, in their '20s and '30s, will want to move out to the big city, establish their own lives, and then don't feel obliged or want to come back. And then that's where kind of the abandoned homes problems comes in. You end up having towns with a lot of elderly people. In a restaurant like this, you won't see any young workers. In fact, you'll see much older employees. Another thing I Notice is many abandoned homes. In fact, Japan has millions of them. So you can see, I mean, a lot of these places have signs. They were businesses. They were open for business, and now all you see is either they're closed or they're abandoned entirely. With young people moving to cities for better jobs, there's a huge amount of homes just sitting empty with no one wanting to buy or live in them. They're on the rise. There are many. There are government initiatives to create what are called kind of abandoned home banks, where they can be registered. But one of the big challenges these local administrations for town offices or city offices have is number one, finding who actually owns them. So a lot of times, even if they are passed away, finding the children or who actually has the rights to those homes is also very difficult. A closed business, a closed business, a business that also just has kind of a negatively compounding effect in terms of revitalization or the community spirit. I meet a local agent who's trying to revitalize the town and encouraging people. Okay, revitalize the town means 复活整个那个 town. Okay, revitalize this agent is trying to revitalize the town means to recover the town because there is nobody there. No young people, no businesses. Yeah, so they offer a very low price. 就是那边的屋子会比较便宜 Okay. People to open up a business. Well, she's like she's taken a lot of kind of、uh, abandoned houses and kind of introduced businesses. So why is Japan's birth rate decline so dramatic? I mean, okay, this is very important. Ah, 注意听 why Japan's birth rate is declining so drastically means 这么严重 I'm in my forties now. 哈四十多岁 but 这个日本人会讲英文的 Okay, but anyway, continue. My forties now. Our fathers kind of built Japan Inc. So they were gone after we fell asleep. So we wouldn't see them at all. They had the kind of samurai bushido spirit that we're fighting for the company, and that has slowly changed. I think that's our generation now is kind of a generation that kind of missed out on that relationship. Maybe is trying to make up for that. People saw their parents overwork. Yeah. Do you see your parents overwork? Yeah. I want to ask, uh, like Shinwei or Cerny. Do you see your parents overwork? Like they work very hard. Do they work very hard? No. No. Or they are just very chill, very relaxed. <laughs> Is it? How many jobs does your father own? How many jobs does he work? Yeah, Shinwei. How many jobs? One job. Oh, one job. I see. Is he? Is he working a lot? Does he work a lot? Maybe. Maybe you never see. Maybe sometimes you see him like very tired like that. Do you? Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah, correct. Parents overwork. If you, even I myself, ah,、huh, last time lah, 
I need to work two jobs. 我需要做两份工，一个是教书 ，I need to teach, and at the same time, I need to work for a Chinese company. I translate the documents for them. 我做翻译员 right? And then I cannot, I cannot. Then I give up on that translating job. I believe at that time, the era, so things will get more expensive. Maybe you need two to three jobs to survive. Seriously, ah,、uh, you all lah. I very pity you all lah. Maybe next time, ah,、uh, you need to work two or three jobs to survive, because things will only get more expensive. Yeah, they see their parents overwork, so the the young people they don't want, they don't want to have kids, right? Because 你看到你你的家人很辛苦做工，为了养你，你会觉得很内疚。You will feel guilty, like I am a burden to my parents. My parents are working so hard to make money, and all this money、uh, goes to me, right? Sacrificing a lot to work and raise a family. Yeah, they sacrifice you a lot. You all can write sacrifice a lot. Parents they sacrifice a lot to raise a family, 就是养一个家庭。所以你看到你会想要走 ？Do you want to follow your parents' footsteps? Yeah. Do you want to follow? Your father, your parents' footsteps. If you see that, like they are so hardworking, do you want to follow their footsteps? Like they cannot relax, they cannot spend money on themselves. 有一些 parents 是那种哦，不舍得花钱在自己身上 ，but then 在孩子身上是很舍得花的。啊、uh, ，I personally see a lot of parents like this. Ah,、啊、很多 parents 是。没有，就是把全部钱倒在孩子身上的那种 ，until they cannot enjoy life. Ah,、啊、they cannot enjoy life. 然后 ，and then their body is so weak. By looking at their face, they are like very tired, very weak like that. Ah,、uh, so as a as a child, you you don't want them to, you don't want to suffer like them lah. Correct. So a lot of、uh, young generation, they don't want to build a family. They don't want to build a family. This is what he is trying to say. This forty-year-old old man. No, not really. <laughs> not really. Uh, yeah, because Malaysia is still okay. Malaysia the things is not so expensive. But in Japan, it's so expensive, right? Yeah. But the new generation is rebelling against that. The, the the new generation is rebelling against that. Rebelling 就是要反要造反的意思 Rebelling against this culture. Okay, this culture is 这样子的文化就是你要呃、uh, sacrifice a lot. To raise a family, this this culture is you need to sacrifice a lot to raise a family. They don't want it. So they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Okay, get it? Okay, so they are rebelling against this culture. Mm, this is very true. You all can write now. The new generation, even 老师现在的年龄啦，很多人都是这样子。If let's say, like 老师问我的朋友啦，二十多岁，哎，怎样哦？你跟你的男朋友哦，你的女朋友几时结婚？哦，我们不打算结婚哦，我们不要孩子。Right? Why? Because they say, 我宁愿把钱花在我自己身上去 travel 哦，从不要花在孩子身上。So There are a lot of a lot of a、uh, young generation, especially, uh, like my age, 很像老师这样的年纪 okay. So they rather spend money, uh, the young generation ah, they rather spend money on themselves, right? Means 他宁愿把钱花自己身上 They don't want to spend the money on raising a kid for twenty years, 二十年呢 All right. Just a little bit more than back in the day. Japan wants to encourage people to have babies, so they're giving money to new moms. But many experts say that it's a losing strategy. Yeah, you see, paying people to make babies is a losing strategy. Japan 尝试过了的
means um 我给你钱你生孩子，你生孩子我就给你钱。But it's a losing in strategy. It's not working. Get it? Yeah. And to really fix this problem, it will need to allow more immigrants to come and also accelerate robots in the world. Hmm. So what happened is Japan is allowing the immigrants to come in. Okay. You all can write allow immigrants. 开始开放了日本。以前他们不开放了，他们是很 mono culture 的意思。呃，等下我跟你们讲什么叫 mono culture。They allow immigrants to come to Japan and accelerate robots. Accelerate 是加快那个速度。Accelerate robots production in the workplace， 就是在工作的地方没有人了吗？年轻人都不要做了。就 robot 来做工 ，understand? This is what the this is what, ah,、uh, happening in Japan, lah. Okay, so, ah,、uh, you can write a lot of Japanese are monoculture. 就是 Japanese people are quite monoculture. Monoculture 是那种很 Uh, Jay, do you know what is monoculture? Um, old culture. Old culture, and what is mono? Do you know what is mono? Uh, like black and white. Ah,、uh, yeah, black and white means one. Actually, mono means one, like monochrome. It's like black color only. Ah.、Uh, Are quite monoculture means they have a very strong sense, a、uh, strong self, and have a strong self identity. 就是很像 like 你们学那个 World War Two 的对的时候对吗？他们是很重视他们的国王的 ，OK， 他们的 Japanese Emperor like the Emperor of Meiji, OK. They are very monoculture means they only mingle with their own kind of people. 就是他们只是跟自己人讲话很多啦。大部分的 Japanese people, especially 老人家也是觉得你很像呃是外来人， then they are like very scared of you 啦。嗯，单元化对单元化就是他们很难接受别的 culture， 可能现在很封闭很。Okay. Workplace, but more on that later. I meet a professor outside of Tokyo to understand what this all means for Japan's future. Shrinking population, shrinking labor force, and aging population has negative impact on both sides of the economy. On the demand side of the economy, so it means consumption, households, more elderly people. It means less consumption. Japan was the second largest economy in the world, but it was surpassed by China. Okay, by the way, uh, 忘记了跟你们讲，呃、uh, ，Japanese people are more monoculture. 哈，其实啦，他们的国，他们的政府 ，the Japanese government 讲 ，Okay, I allow immigrants to come to Japan. 为什么 ？Why 啊 ？Why? Do you know why, Jingxiang? Why the government needs to allow immigrants to come to Japan? Why 啊？ They want to encourage people to spend their money to increase their economy. Ah,、uh, can or another one? I would say, um, they want the immigrants to come and work for the Japanese people. Ah,、uh, means because the labor force is so low, 没有人都没有日本人了。没有年轻人了 ，then 就要外国的年轻人过来 serve 他们咯。Understand? Yeah. So when the Japanese hear about this news, they are very angry. Ah, like 你怎么给这样多外国人进来 ？All right. Ah,、uh, get it? Hmm. So we don't know. Ah, okay. 怕可能怕外国人来 attack 他们还是什么吧 ？Because Japan has a very dark history. Japanese, uh, I mean, Japan has a very dark history. You all know that. Stripping, 
世界第二大战 ，you know Japanese have killed so many people, millions of people, right? Yeah, so the Japanese, I don't know lah. Maybe they are scared that people will come and revenge, take revenge on them, 就是来报仇啊，把他们的国家毁掉啊。So I can understand that. And then, um, China has also surpassed Japan now because 以前日本是很国家很繁荣的地方 but now it has uh changed. China has out has surpassed Japan already. Okay. About ten years ago, but to stay a large economy, it will need to produce goods and services, and people here need to spend money. They are yeah, people here need to spend their money like what. Uh, he said just now, why allow immigrants to come to work for the Japanese people and to spend money? 在他们的日本那里花钱，那么经济会更加好。Okay. Already have houses. They no need to change their cars. They married already, so the expenditures and the expenses on consumption is much lower. But the trend of disappearing towns. Is... So you all can follow this guy. He's called Uptin. And then he actually posted a lot of uh, very interesting videos. Got part two lah. You if you are interested to know more about this, you can uh, watch part two. I will send the link to you, and you can enjoy watching it. So I hope you are benefited from this video. Uh, from this session, right? And hope to see you all next week. See you and goodbye. Thank you, Miss Kara. Goodbye. You're welcome. Bye. Bye bye. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye, Mr. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Bye. Bye.